Yo, 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 what's up guys? You're seeing Adgashi here. Yesterday we was eating at Leila's restaurant and next table was a guy. He told us, go to Sutai Muay Thai. It's the best gym around. Then we straight wrote them we want to come and we did the appointment. Today we put in the navigation and it figures out it's like one hour drive. So still guys, we keep our word, we go there and this gym, Sutai, supposedly to be one of the best gyms here in Phuket. We want to show you around. Let's go. Bam, bam, bam. Let's go. Also guys, we have today the Dragon Ball shirt on. This week, unfortunately, Akira Toriyama died, the founder of Dragon Ball. So rest in peace, give him all a prayer. The most safest way in Thailand to drive is with bike and cab. We took in this case a taxi, we use both because with the app, you can decide by yourself how much you want to pay. I love it. Excuse me. Can you open the bag, please? Oh, come, come. What's your name? What's your name? Egg. Egg? egg. Oh, I like eggs. Also, today, guys, we have a special guest with us, Victoria. She's a German bodybuilder. Let's see what she's gonna say. Yeah, I'm Victoria. I'm 23 years old. I'm from Germany. I'm a bodybuilding competitor, but now I change the sports. I do now normal boxing. Started just now, live in Thailand for three months now, and uh, yeah, let's have some fun today. Some fun facts Sutai is the translation for to die in a fight before you give up. So, Sutai Muay Thai, and it's a cool rap. Also, the Instagram is like not so bad, they have a lot of content, they have a lot of followers. I like it. So, Victoria. You was a successful bodybuilder, you did take part in competitions and now you moved to martial arts, yeah? Um, why do you like martial arts more or why did you change? So for me bodybuilding was a very important part of my whole life. I do it like, I started in the gym like 15 years old and I do it now professional. I'm not a pro but I did competitions now for three years last year. I had two competitions, but um, since I'm Thailand, I recognize I want to abuse steroids. I don't want to take it anymore because um, it's not good for your health. And the sports of boxing gives me and my personality much more. I go out of training and I feel much more better than from bodybuilding. Bodybuilding, you go into the gym and you do all the time the same stuff. Many people of you think uh, that the most Thais live in straw hats and small houses. But check this house, this is insane. Even Obama would be jealous. Again, we forgot to buy our drinks, so we're going to 7-Eleven. Come with us, very fast. So guys, I took now plum juice and berry juice. It looks very healthy, I don't know what's inside. And I took a root beer, I love it. I need some sugar to gain some real power before the training. And what I also realized is, Vicky's back is bigger than the one from the camera guy. <laughs> And this all we just bought for approximately four dollars. That's crazy. How is it? In Albania we say if it don't taste good, it's healthy. This one is very healthy. <laughs> yeah, that's probably good for you. <laughs> but it could taste like shit. Yeah. Yeah, Maybe. it was thick. There was like berries in it too. Yeah. Oh, it's plum juice. Yeah, I mean, it tasted like plum juice. So guys, we almost arrived. The gym is based in Surin and um, it's close to Bang Tao. So it's a very quiet area. It's upcoming, but they have here very beautiful areas and uh, Bang Tao is considered as the Beverly Hills of Phuket. So I think big, big future here. Yes, guys, we arrived. Let's go. You know what's the crazy thing, guys? I was driving this gym many times and I said to myself, I want to do here a documentary. And now it's this one. I didn't know it. My name is Bia. Everyone, welcome to Sutai Muay Thai, Thailand, in Phuket. Guys, I can tell you this gym is insane, yeah? 
it's not just behind the castle or what it is, but it also have like two big rings, different version of bags, and it's surrounded by the forest, by the jungle. And what's also funny is they have one barber shop where you can get the perfect Peaky Blinders cut. And also next to the Muay Thai and boxing, they have here a Gracie BJJ mat class. I love it. It looks awesome. Let's go inside. Thanks. Uh, hey, my name is uh, Coach Anandu. I'm the head coach of Gracie Bahapuket, and uh, I trained here for six years. And that's why we um, teach all the Jiu Jitsu class on this area here. So we have a kids class and adults class uh, twice a day, morning and evenings, and uh, is uh, all levels. Most of the guys here come on holiday or they live here. So that's the, the Jiu Jitsu club here, Grace Baha Phuket. Crazy, they have here a Gracie. It's like the founder of the modern BJJ. I love it. Also straight next to the gym, they have a place where you can have your breakfast and have delicious drinks and next to it they have a crazy supplement store i think this is what victoria actually needs she needs some vitamin d and here guys already looks like you can see some successes of the fighters here are some medals i love it they're a very good place so when you eat you have a good motivation and also they have like a nice place where all the fighters can sleep so with apartments everything is included i love it also they have a crazy shop where you can buy gloves where you can buy geese all the stuff. If you have Sunday sparring, you know, this motherfuckers who say like, oh, I forgot my mouth card. Here, you say, no, I buy you one. Get this one, and bam, knockout. She own a people. My name is It, but for fighter name in Kai Thong. But I saw training in Sutayim and eight years already in the trainer. But before I start to training in eight years. Okay. But now my eight and 58. Oh, 58. Oh, 58 nice. already now. Okay, guys, the coach is ready. Ip Man, the famous Wing Chun coach. So yeah, I'm excited. Let's get it on. Let's get changed. Now let's get it on, guys. Uh, my name's Joey. Uh, I'm from Australia. Uh, I prefer the smaller gym. Gives you more of a um, connection to the trainers. They teach you a bit more. I feel like you get lost in amongst the big gyms. So many people. Uh, unless you're like a top, top fighter, then you get focused on. So for me, as a semi-beginner, I want to be, um, yeah, taught more stuff. And I feel like I get lost in Bangtao. What you can do? With Calisthenics. Yeah. Can you show us some stuff? <laughs> also, what's here very nice, they have here a table tennis table. I like ping pong. No ping pong show, but ping pong. It's awesome. So the training starts and we go straight to skipping rope. Guys, I hit skipping rope. I'm gonna say I have to go to the toilet and come back when it's over. What's your impression of the gym so far? Very nice. Very friendly people, nice area. Guys, it's very humid here, I love it. You start straight to sweat. Now after skipping rope, after running, we go to stretching. What I already love about the coach is that he speaks perfect English, so it's good to understand him. For training everyone, you know, for youth, uh, your muscle and body to, to, warm, to up. warm up, yeah, sure. If you come and start, you know, sometimes like... Injury, something Yeah, 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 something. Senat Gashi. Fucking hell, you got 700,000 followers. Uh, my name is Jacob, I'm from Czech Republic. I work as a nurse and I got around 150 fights. And I don't drink alcohol and don't do drugs. I thought about uh, going to Bangtao because there's like 80 people on sparring and I need, mostly I need sparrings. So, uh, yeah, but I choose Sutai because a friend of mine was here and he said that it's good gym and the trainers are friendly. So 
for first like first time Thailand I tried to tie and it's good decision. It's so humid here. Now we go to the reps. Let's check it out. Yo guys, what's up? Over 82% of you are watching the videos but still haven't subscribed the channel. So click on the subscribe button and follow the channel. And then you see the button. You know what's the benefit if you have tits and an ass? The coach come and you're gonna wrap your hands. You're gonna laugh, you're gonna make your jokes. Meanwhile, I need to do it by myself, like every time. <laughs> Is your gloves? No, I forgot my gloves at home. Professional. I like how they found you pink gloves. I don't like pink, but I take them. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we go straight to the pets. And uh, I recommend every time when you do pets to wear at least 40 to 60 rounds. Like this, you have more weight on the hand. And uh, this gives you like also speed later on. I love it. It's the first time with a coach. I'm a little bit off timing, but you need to adapt every time new. It's like sparring. I love it. She has a very big back, very big legs. If she learn how to use all her power, she's going to be great. Nice. I really love to work with the coach. He's really engaged with the pet work. And the good thing, he speaks English. I love it. Just the worst thing is, our taxi driver is all time watching and waiting on us. Same like the sparring partner. So you have a head guard on already? It's not like that. I'm scared that uh, I use head guard every every sparring. You can ask the guys. Every sparring I use head guards because I'm I'm scared of uh, no, not scared. I it's my prevention of uh, cuts. You know, I want to spar. I want to fight. So if I got cut, like accidentally, I wouldn't be able to. So I use head guard every every training. Yeah, I mean that's definitely good practice. I understand. What I like about the coaches, he explains everything slowly. He breaks exercise down. Fiki, it's already her third week in boxing, so she, st she still didn't have the right understanding of it, yeah? But this guy is so patient, really, he takes his time. I'm already pissed when I see Vicky, I just want to smash her. In, in boxing, right? Yeah. When now when she punching, you know, she pan with uh, her hand. Yeah, inside. Not, not pan with uh, punching. Yeah. You know, sometimes, you know, from, from here, now she pan like this. But you see, for punching. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> no, no, no. Mm. But if punching, you know, sometimes like, like also, this? if, no, no, if, no, no, no. if boxing, also, sometimes foul, oh. you pan like this. Yeah. Yeah, because the point is here. Yeah. To pan, you, don't, you cannot do like that. It's yeah. foul. For for, yeah, 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 yeah. for Olympic or something, you, you cannot punch like no, this. No, you cannot. No, no. It's foul. Yeah, have to do. Also here, you cannot do like this. Mm. Yeah, okay, have to. Upper okay. cut or hook, something. Yes. It's fucked up. I train like three weeks now, so I'm very bad, I know this. But it's okay for three weeks, it's okay. But he is a very good trainer. Before I was also in, uh, in training, and um, yeah, but he's very good. Because um, I am a Muslim. Now the, in oh, no, no, Ramadan, no, 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 no. I have to uh, like fatin. Mm -hmm. Now it time like six forty. Have to start no. to eat after sunrise. After after sundown, yeah. we have to start nice. eating. Guys, yeah. what many people don't know is in Phuket there are so many Muslims. It's called actually the Muslim Island. The people who are not Muslim, they're from outside. They're Buddhist, but most of the people in Phuket are Muslims. Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Never do, never. No, no, never do. I do every year, every month. Wow. I have never do. He does every year Ramadan. Training people, giving classes, this is like the highest sign of respect. What I also love about this gym is every gloves are like available for everybody, everybody can take it.
Especially me, I like this blue rope. I wish I could ride one day. It's amazing. You okay? How are you feeling? I feel good because I train a little bit condition, but I'm a bodybuilder, you know? I always do just strength training and not this coordination. And I've got power, but I'm a little bit too strong. I have to be more smooth, more easy, and I have to learn the techniques. But now I train for three weeks, so come on, guys. I guess it's generally normal. We will continue. Yeah, I think if you learn how to use that power correctly, you're going to be a beast. Yeah, that's it. And I need this technique, and I'm a little bit scared. I'm because I had some accidents with my hand and stuff. And when I train, I'm, I'm too focused and I always need 30 minutes to get into the groove and stuff. But I will try to give my best. So the rink is a bit strange. I don't feel so well here. Let's go back outside, yeah? Some plate in the to 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 cook what? Yeah. You know, some... Yeah, yeah like maybe plate mm -hmm. go down. Mm -hmm. So you can see the opponent is coming from Muay Thai and the distance feeling is very different but he's a big guy but yeah it's also a bit down to speed so now we try to stay stand and stand punch by punch Coach, what is your favorite technique in boxing and why? See, one, two, and the guy move to hook and use like uppercut, hook, pun. See, one, two, up, up, hook, up, 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 I think she just needs the right gloves. Yeah, it's gloves. That's the magic. Nice. So guys, training is over. Awesome facility. Now we do a proper cool down. Therefore we start stretching from head to the toes. We do everything. The shoulders, the chest, the knees and the toes. And like that, we are ready for tomorrow. Also what I like here on the gym is they have everything what you need. But also you see this small utilities this is where they make the difference, like these rubbers, like the thick tire ropes, and like the leather. It's very important, I love it. With this band guy, I can tell you, you can make crazy warm-up exercises. It's very good for rotation, like this. Look at the core is straight, but the legs are full extended. I love it. A very good exercise for dynamic stretching, very nice. <laughs> also what I like is these bags but I'm not sure if they're gishin gun proof so if I, left a pen, uh, if I land a punch if they still stand let's see if they stand the gishin gun punch <laughs> <laughs> there's the thumbnail right there dude right there you're the big thing like me and then you can do it Coach P, thank you very much for the training. Yeah. It's a beautiful place here. I every time was driving by and I said every time this gym I want to do a documentary and today I'm here. Lovely, training very nice. I like how you hold the pets, yeah. Did you work before with boxing too, with boxers? Did you work before? No, no, never. No, I do someone with for boxing, but I pet Muay Thai for I be caught some trainer, something 25 years up already, only trainer. But I do some time for boxing, no, for trainer boxing. Yeah. 
but normally I fight only Muay Thai. Oh, but nice. I know I know how to do boxing, but not very good uh, because no, I, 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 just, I, I come it. for do Muay Thai. You, do you have sometimes also boxers here who come around here to train? Before we have from also guy from Russia in the he come to training here after yeah. he moved to uh, Tiger uh, Tiger Tiger because he he like to fight but here not many people do uh, boxing. Nice. But he yeah. had to something partner to sparring and is fight in Bangkok or he like now he turned pro to eight round. Nice, nice, nice. Young boy, uh, 19. Yeah, I think year. I know blonde guy, yeah? Tall, blonde? No, not tall. The uh, weight only 60 kilos. 60? 60. Only 61 kilos. Uh, I, boy, boy. I don't know this kind of people. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Russia, yeah. nice. Um, Bangtao, more and more gyms are coming here. Now you have many now, gyms here. Now yeah? in Bangtao, we have one, two, five, five, five gyms here. Yeah. Uh, Why do they come all here? What, what, what is good about Bang Tao? Why they come here? No, because Bang Tao, uh, he moved from Tiger Muay Thai. Yeah. Before everyone, the owner and some partner in from Tiger, yeah. and he moved to Bang Tao and that last two years. Yeah, okay, nice. Two year. but, and, uh, but he could marketing because he why, many. But why many people come here? There are many people here, like many gyms. Why open new gyms here all the time? Uh, no, I think the, the here, in in from from only from overseas from Europe. Yeah. The first time we did gym. First time we yeah. got from nine years before. Yeah. And after that, someone come to training here. Yeah. And think about more business yeah, to, yeah, to yeah. do, and then you know have to grow from here. Many also from uh, Balan Muay Thai. Yeah. From the main many gym they come to training here. Nice. And then and they open and own business. Yeah, they go out to open yeah, this nice. business or something. So this is the inspiration of many gyms, yeah? Yeah, yeah. For but for for own gym in in Bang Tao, in owner from Thailand named uh, Pitak Bang Tong. Okay. He because I stay here before, thirty years before. Oh thirty yeah, years? Yeah yeah, 30, wow. more, more than thirty years, but I come here something thirty years before in with him. Nice. But nice. now it's still but not so big gym because he yeah, had small plate, but also have many people that come to training here. Nice, but now nice. when Bang Tao Muay Thai coming, everyone go there because you know have uh, many fighter, many yeah. partner to clinching, to sparring. But here, eighty percent beginner. Okay. Yeah. yeah, not not so many. Okay, yeah. from, but in Bang Tao, someone you know have uh, professional from MMA, yeah. UFC. Muay Thai yeah, yeah. and everything, yeah. Jiu Jitsu and yes. uh, CrossFit and yeah. On yeah, but, everything. But yeah, this yeah. gym is awesome too. Yeah, the gym, but small, little bit. You know, we have, also, we have Jiu Jitsu, we have Muay Thai, also but a little bit. But if it's bit smaller, more. better quality. If you have too many people, yeah, yeah, no, no, quality. No, yeah, yeah, no quality. So it's yeah. nice, no, no. Okay, my friend, I wish you and your team just the best and yeah, success. Thank you, thank, thank you. you. Uh, thank you. 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 I love the style of the coach. Very beautiful. Nice shot. I, next time, give me one, yeah? Next time, I want so the same I shot. The, someone say because I make only L number. My son do for me, but my picture. Nice. Boy Kai and uh, Rekis, uh, Rasta. Music. Oh, you make Rasta music? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you like? Wait. Yeah, I like the Rasta. I have present for you. No, no, I know some more. No, 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 no